Hi guys, we are about to embark on our quick holiday in the mountains in Oberstdorf, which is in the south of Germany. I'd like to take you with us. And we arrived. Look how much stuff we packed for just four days in the mountains. So we arrived after a four and a half hours drive and we are here in a little hotel room which is more like a family room and it has two separate rooms which will be amazing because we can actually stay awake a little after the kids bedtime and yeah the main feature is the view let me quickly show you this is the view mountains everywhere and then there is here usually a cow and now some chicken and some sheep but i don't think we are going to do a lot of walking today we're just going to go out and grab a bite to eat and yeah have a little look around and all the stuff retreat because the kids are yeah. completely tired and completely crazy and they almost destroyed the place and just started to throw around pizza so yeah um we're heading home and they are going to be put to bed and it's so much fun going out with kids okay we are back home and we are currently in the living room which is where we are going to sleep because the kids are in the bedroom and it's to wish you good night and in case anyone, anyone's wondering yes mr loka is growing a beard which i like because <laughs> i prefer wolverine over edward cohen any day and very important to mention that this part is not gray it's a very very light blonde I don't think I told you guys, but the first time we went here was when we were just a couple for uh, three months or something like that. And it was a romantic hideaway and it was after a night spent well with little sleep. Um, we went out and had breakfast out here looking at the mountains. It was pure romance and it's so, so different right now. Now pure bliss is the husband taking the kids to see um, the goats and I'm having tea in peace. So we have breakfast and now we're planning to go to Kleinwalsertal which is um, through the mountains over to Austria and yeah do some shopping but not the kind of shopping that excites me. So of course um, we need some uh, sunglasses for our son and then yeah do a little walk and let's see where the day takes us. moment with you. I used to carry both my kids until where they were about six months, something like that, but then I stopped, especially with my son, because he is he's a tall boy, he is 90 centimeters and he weighs almost 13 kilograms. But we went to the pool today after a long walk. He was so tired and so cranky and I needed him to nap for at least 20 minutes or half an hour because otherwise we wouldn't have made it through um, dinner. So I took him into the baby sling and went for a short walk and he immediately fell asleep and yeah, he's heavy but it's it's such a rare moment of love because yeah, once they cuddle against your chest and fall asleep and get all heavy I'm going to miss them when they grow up. Day 
we had some breakfast and it was raining this morning so that's like all the stuff and the sun came out and we are about to go for a small hike as much hike as you can do with the kids to a nearby lake give you some party details or anything like that but you when you travel with kids <laughs> you realize that the baby monitor doesn't reach into the bar area of the hotel you spend real quiet evening so i'm not going to lie it's half past nine and i think we are about to zone out The things you never see on Instagram. Breakfast with kids. It's kind of rainy today, so we're still debating what we're going to do. Uh, it stopped raining and hopefully it will stay dry for a few hours. So we really want to get outside, but yeah, we won't go too far in case we get caught in the rain. I really wanted to film a decent outro of last of yesterday's trip, but yeah, the camera died and I didn't have the charger with me. So here I am, our last day, and it's on me to pack. And do you know the saying that some people can turn a house into a home or a flat into a home within seconds? Well, my family can turn a flat into a pitch of chaos. It's done. The car is packed and we are sad to leave Trunk. It was a really, really nice stay. I'm going to share a little more about the hotel we stayed in on the vlog if you fancy a read. Um, yeah. But now it's time to drive home and do the laundry. Ooh. See you.